Hey everyone, I'm Cole Miller. I'm a support center rep here at the CNB Operations Field Office in Sioux Falls, and today I'll be showing you how to update a 2630. So in order to get the latest software version for our 2630, we're going to open up our internet browser and we're going to search for Stellar Support My John Deere. And it'll be the first link that pops up there. We're going to go ahead and click that and it'll bring up the Stellar Support page. Since we're looking for software updates, we're going to go ahead and click that. And it'll bring up this page with all of the different software updates that we have. Uh, for our displays, receivers, controllers, uh, things like that. So we're using our 2630 today, so we're going to click that. Um, and it'll show the release date um, as well as the version that we have available. So it is the 3.36.1073. And they also have links for the release note features and uh, a link for the software installation instructions. But we're going to go ahead and click the download now button and it's going to bring up this GS Live Update setup file. We're going to go ahead and click that and run that. And it's going to bring up this GS Live Update setup page. Um, you can select your country and your language and click Next. And then we're going to select our Green Star display that we have. We have the 2630, so we're going to click that and click Next. And here we have the license agreement um, for you to look at and read through and then go ahead and agree to the terms of this agreement and click next. And it is going to start downloading the live update app for our 2630 display. Once that is finished installing, it'll bring up this page and we can go ahead and leave that box checked to create a shortcut on our desktop and click next and then it'll uh, tell you to click next to check for updates so that's what we'll do we'll click next and then here we can select our display model um, because we only selected the 2630 on that previous page that will be the only display that pops up here so that's okay and then we need to select our drive uh, that we want the update to go on to. Um, we have our USB plugged into our computer here, and that is the name of it, so that's good to go. And we can click Copy Now. It'll start copying those uh, update softwares for our 2630 display uh, onto our USB stick. So once that is finished copying, it'll bring up this page, letting us know that our software update successfully copied to our USB. So we can go ahead and click close. And if we look on our desktop here, our GS Live update app right up here uh, was installed to our desktop. So that's good to go. And if we open up our files manager and find our USB stick, we can see that our latest software version for our 2630 was copied to this USB. So we can go ahead and unplug that and get ready to plug it into our display and update the latest software version for our 2630. So now that we have our software on our USB stick, we can go ahead and open up the side of the 2630 and plug in our USB. And once we do that, this page will come up. Don't have to press anything yet until the software update shows up on the screen and we have the correct software displayed on there so we can hit accept and it will update the software from the usb stick so once our software is done updating the screen will pop up saying that it was successfully installed and we can hit accept it'll save the settings of the display and then the screen will restart automatically so once your display boots back up the license agreement will pop up on the screen and at the bottom the checkbox will say I'm the purchaser of this display. Click that and then click accept and agree and it should be up to date. So once we come out of that agreements page we hit menu, message center and reprogram 
and our Green Star Display 2630 is listed on top with the newest software version. And that is how you update software on a 2630 display. For more info on how to optimize your machine, visit our YouTube. I'm Cole Miller with CNB Operations, where real tractors are green.